Saturday the 4th of August and I'm back to have a look at the bees um, at Dad's. It's about 26 degrees. It's about 2 o'clock in the afternoon. During the week, um, last Tuesday, I had a look at hive number one and hive number two. Hive number two, I cut out a couple of queen cells. Hive number one didn't have any queen cells. It had eggs, but again, I didn't see that lovely queen that we'd marked two weeks ago. I've made loads of sugar syrup to feed the bees. Because it's been so hot and dry, um, the bees are finding it very difficult to find any forage around as far as uh, nectar flow is concerned. Um, and I want to have a little peek in the, the supers that we do have on hive number two and hive number one just to see um, what the state of play is. I suspect that what's happened is because it's been so hot they've eaten to any stores that they put in there during the spring and now um, I'm not even sure um, that they're collecting much at all. Sugar syrup that I've given them in the last couple of weeks they've been eating like crazy. Um, so that sort of tells me that there's not a lot of, um, well there is no nectar flow on now and um, they're hungry. So we'll continue to feed them um, and uh, just hope for the best really going into autumn. Um, so I'm going to start the smoker up and we'll get cracking. It's funny that every time you go to light the newspaper there's always a bit of a breeze around. Probably. Nice, right, sit on the go. I'm not quite sure which hive to look at today to start with. The nuke needs to um, be put into a brood box which I brought over. Start off with this this hive. You want to see eggs, we want to see brood. We want to see the queen if we can. What we don't want to see is queen cells. Lots of bit of brood, a bit of young larva. Now, can I see any eggs? Yep, I can see some eggs. And on this side. Nothing on this phone, there are some eggs here, so that's good. This one. They're still building up this colony, so there's no need for a super on just yet. We've got some lava, some brood, lots of young lava. On this side, more lava. 
yolks and eggs. Okay. No queen yet. Could be. We've got a little bit of nectar coming. Oh, there's the queen. She's um right there. So we do still have her. That's great. Great. I mean, I, I don't expect them to want to swarm. If you can't see her, she's right there. If I point her out, you'll be able to see her. So she's looking good. She's looking good. So we still have our queen. Um, I'm just going to check for queen, any queen cells because, you know, these, these ladies sometimes just... decide to swarm for no reason. They shouldn't really swarm from this this brood box. Oh, these short plugs, I've got to do something about them. Um, I've got lots of nectar. So I think what I'm going to do down on this side Some brood. So I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to just check out and see what they're doing on this one. Building it up. So we're going to put that in the middle here. Like that. I think that's how we'll do it. We'll checkerboard it so there's one, 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 like so. And before, let's just see what they're doing with their stores. This feels heavy. Oh, oh yeah, plenty of honey on this side. Plenty of honey being built on that side as well. So I'll let them carry on as they mean to carry on with that. Check aboard that one. The queen is on this one. And with any luck, that should encourage them to. feed these girls right, right at the end of the day before I leave. Right, so they're doing all right. I should expect them to do. <laughs> what you'd hope them to do. Right, the other two hives we need to see are in the a much shadier. We've got this neat box. We've got pollen going in, so that looks hopeful. And we've got this brood box here. I'm just concerned that because they're in a nuke box, they'll have made a queen cell or two. And I'm not sure whether sort of activity we're going to have. Yeah, I mean, look, I mean, they're so hungry. And I don't like working right at the front of the hive. Yeah, look at that. I mean, they, these girls kind of need to go into a, a food box. We've marked the queen in here. I just want to make sure that she's still in here and that they haven't swarmed within the last because last weekend it was really really windy I mean gusts of 30 35 and did you do yourself a cut? no right, okay. we had gusts of 35 degrees uh, 35 winds and um I didn't want to. So I could take these ladies home. Uh, 
um, in preparation for uh, taking them home. But because we want to feed them first, I'm just going to lay that down. Maybe, maybe tomorrow, uh, Sunday, I'll take them home Sunday evening. Let's um, open up this hive now and see if they've finished all their sugar syrup as well. It's funny, at the start of the season, they weren't taking any sugar syrup whatsoever. And I was getting really frustrated because I wanted them to build up after the spring, after the winter, into the spring, and they just weren't interested. Obviously, because there was an to flow on and then I think great if it's going to be like this all summer into the summer this is going to be fantastic and then of course we've had blisteringly hot weather which has meant that that's had a knock-on effect on the plants and then they just haven't been able to produce any wax uh, there's not enough nectar flow on and it's all been a bit pants really so they're really really hungry so the fact that they're taking sugar syrup now is a very strong indicator that, you know, what little flow there was is now over. There's not a lot of forage on and they could be struggling a fair bit. In here. We did see, we marked the Queen just over 10 days ago. So I don't see why she would have gone all of a sudden. We've got some capped brood. Haven't seen you. Mm. Aha! A play cup. Anything in it? There's nothing in it though. Mm. Don't see any eggs as yet. frame that's uh, again what used to be a super when they first entered this hive. And the queen was originally on this on this frame I seem to remember. There's the queen, she was the dark slender one I remember. She was the, oh there she is, we've got the queen, the queen is just, well, just very carefully, she's just there and she's, she's very pretty. She's quite small, but she's very pretty. So she, I must have eggs somewhere. Oh yeah, I can see eggs on this frame. So that's good. Right, maybe, maybe that'll encourage you to make some wax on that frame. I've got this one here as well. Well, take that queen that's screwed off, there's no need for it. good and then they'll want to feed as well. Do. 